What is up, fam? How this message finds you all well and good spirits? Today's a great day, a special day. We're going to have the all new 2023 Corvette C8 Z06 versus Carnage, the 2020 Shelby stock GT500. <laughs> lighter than the GT500 and my goodness it just it just hooks Woo! what is up fam what is message finds you all well and good spirits today's a great day a special day we're gonna have the all new 2023 Corvette C8 Z06 versus Carnage, the 2020 Shelby stock GT500. Now, why is it stock when there's so many Shelby GT500s like our own personal car that's modified to the hill? Because this is going to be a giveaway car. If you go to the link in description and sign up for email and text alerts, you'll know when this goes live. So go now on through supply. We're also giving away a 1965 Rangu Mustang with about 190, 170 spots up. I don't know the current amount, but limited spots on through supply.com. A C, that Z06 come from Street Speed, next. What's up, baby? I know, oh, school bus. Got the school bus here. It's not like crazy fast. I think that's for the ZR1 when that comes out, but I mean, it's it's quick for what it is. It's, it's a quick. track car. Yeah, it's pretty quick. But it's gorgeous looking. You got the carbon fiber wheels. Talk, tell me about like... Oh, What's your opinion on it versus C8? Oh, it's way better than a base model. Sure. Yeah. yeah. You can't go back to the base model after driving this one. Well, it's a 5.5 liter. Five and a half liter. Uh, flat plane. Yep. NA. Just so you know, uh, Ford was first uh, with the flat uh, plane in America. Just saying. First ones to ever do it. <laughs> Besides but, everybody in Europe. But my, but my question is, with the exhaust, with the carbon fiber wheels, do you think it's going to beat the GT500 today? No. No? I think mid-range it'll be close i was trying to get my intro clip you're going to say absolutely and then <laughs> you know <laughs> color is this uh, accelerate yellow all right and this has got the carbon fiber package the everything, everything you can 30, get 700 pounds so how much does this cost msrp 175 okay yeah. tj I mean, all out i will I, honestly if it were my so specs, what's the story for the people who don't mine know was again? about 150. you bought well, TJ's? tj yeah he ordered this did the whole process they picked him and it came in and he was like I'll what is that pick and i want to build an m4 instead what so does it pick he gave up this one mean? and i took it like what is that pick them process That's gm they GM. decide okay, see it's gm so he was like, why? He was like, like and he was like, why did Beaver get him a, uh, the first one? I was like, that's not his choice. Like, oh, no, it's GM. I was like, yeah. it's GM. It's not them. It so. G that was all high up GM. What you got? I mean, if you close your eyes. Yo, yeah. I mean, Ferrari or it's not Audi. does not do it no justice. no no it sounds really good thank you stay tuned we're going to be racing the gt500 and this z06 but first before we go any further i'm going to be driving the track carbon fiber c8 z06 guys we are in manual mode is just that m button okay if you want to use that and then that's pretty much it all right sounds good thank you sir uh that was street sweet telling me how to drive his two hundred thousand dollar whoo that is nice corvette z06 started up here oh wow that's nice nice screens and we got a ford man in the z06 this that's exotic sounding, yo. 
Right. But you know, driving this, wow, it feels really incredible. I mean, I get like video game vibes driving this, guys. This is nice. I like the steering wheel here. Car, this is from the factory too. This is something that you would see heated steering wheel too. You would see this in aftermarket, but it is pretty tight in there. I'm a bigger guy, but it is, you're, you know you're in something special here. That's for sure. I expected more NVH too with it being a flat plane crank, but this is pretty incredible. approaching two hundred thousand dollars and it makes sense it makes sense this car is really a treat to drive and you know i drove the c8 before but you know that was still the you know push rod this is exotic this feels great and i love even on local roads it feels so easy to drive Backfire is something else. So, let's turn in here. Oh, wow. Let me just. This is a little weird, the, the reverse, but you can get used to that really quickly. Nice cameras. We're back in drive. I do like this a lot, guys. This is freaking nice. So, so what are my thoughts as a Ford guy? Good job, GM. This is a really nice vehicle. Uh, very, very, I mean, one of the most, it's, it's tight, it's light, it's fast, it's nimble. It feels like I'm in something special. It feels like a bullet like it's really you know i drove the 500 here and that's a whole different experience it's more of a muscle car you know heavier vibe but you can feel that this is much lighter it's about 500 pounds lighter than the gt500 and my goodness it just it just hooks That's everyone's always talking about. So now those are the brakes. <laughs> those are the carbon ceramic brakes, which is like normal. But uh, I tell you what, this is this is pretty good. So tire status is cool. All right, 
morning, so it's too cold to do a dig, but uh, from a roll, this thing just hooks. Well, that's our little stint with the, those cars are a break, man. That's our stint with the Z06, guys. Tell me what you think, comment below. Who do you think is going to win the GT500 race? think it's fantastic. And I'm, I'm more happy that it's an American car, so. I had to buy one, guys. Listen, I love I love Mustang and Fora, but I got to give GM and, and Fora back credit. This What's is a heck of a vehicle. I'm so glad you let me buy this off you, bro. Okay. Like, this is incredible. I'll man. enjoy it. I've never blown up for it. <laughs> well, if there's one thing to take away from it, I think it's that when America innovates some really, you know yeah, really they're, cool stuff. They're capable of something like this. And the, all, my only critique of this car, only critique, is everyone was looking at me when I slow down because carbon ceramic brakes is squealing like... I think <laughs> we were just talking about that. Something wrong. I think it needs new pads or something. I don't know what's going on with those. But carbon ceramics? No, you've got to change yeah. pads. you got to yeah. change the pads. But besides that... <laughs> I've never had that. I mean, that's...